one of the things you've got to consider as the facilitator is are the right people enrolled in the course and those people that are enrolled in the course are they engaging in any meaningful way and the easy way to do this is to use the participants link and uh, go in and have a look who's enrolled now in my case the class is tidy and not particularly useful but you can tell from this list who is enrolled and you can run your eye over it to make sure that that's correct you can also see to what extent there is uh, activity and you'll see the second to last column last access to the course gives us some indication as to when they have come into the system now this isn't particularly useful on the screen here, so I'm going to click over to another course that I'm working with at the moment, and I'm going to do the same thing. Here you're going to see a lot more information. Um, I'm going to click on participants in the left hand column, and now we can see that in this particular group there are actually 146 people enrolled for this course and can organize them according to their first name or their surnames. Um, in this case, uh, let's get them by their surnames, beginning with A's. There you can see all the A's and so on. Uh, and we can see their email address. Uh, on this particular course, uh, they're organized into OTLs or outreach team leaders and master trainers and so on. Normally, you'd see um, students and teachers, etc. But what's really interesting is that second to last column there, last access to the course. And uh, you can see that it gives us an approximate time when they were last active on the system. So if I click on here, I can say, show me all those people um, who are most recently in the system. So we can see there are a couple of people who've been in here during the course of today, but it looks like uh, these people were there yesterday and then these people in subsequent days. Obviously the course is not running, otherwise you'd find a lot more people actually having short amount of times at the top of this column. You can even click on it and have a look that there's a considerable number of people who have never accessed this particular course. So now there should be alarm bells ringing as to why is this so, and should they be even enrolled in this course? Perhaps they're in the wrong place. Keep an eye on that. Easy to check, uh, very quick, and uh, very interesting information.